Now, look what we've got here. This, everybody, is the demo of Shine of Ice, which is a total conversion mod for Grand Theft Auto Vice City. It features a new storyline, new missions, new characters, new character models, and new vehicles. Let's get started. So the main character is Flint Casey from Liberty City. 1987, Vice City. And I apologise in advance for my dreadful voice acting and the fact that I speak a bit too quickly at times. So this demo only covers Act 1 of this mod. So this playthrough right here is going to be um, a bit short compared to some other playthroughs. Hello? Flint? Yeah, hi Jeffrey. I'm into the hotel. I was expecting your call hours ago. What the hell took you so long? The flight was delayed because of the damn fog. Listen, uh, I'll be closing up the joint real soon. If you hurry up, we can still make, make it to the funeral on time. You want me to come pick you up, is that it? I, uh, just had my license suspended. Sure. Your place is called the Prime something? It's the Premier, just around the corner from Raphael's. You remember? Look, Flynn, I'm really sorry about your brother, man. It's a real shame what happened. You know, I heard a cop saying it wasn't a regular house fire. I'll go get ready. Don't get lost, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I'll keep that in mind, Jeff. See you soon. Good. So I have um, noticed that uh, the mod is a bit crash-prone during the opening cutscene. I'd say you're pretty much good to go once you get past the opening cutscene without any crashes. Okay. So before I... Uh, well, first of all, I'm going to adjust the mouse sensitivity again, yeah. I've noticed that in... I think GTA 3 as well as Vice City, when you start a new game, the mouse sensitivity shoots up. No idea why. Anyway, let's go. Oh, look at that sky. How delightful. And once again, the music volume is turned down. In case you're wondering, the Mission Past jingle in this mod is just the same as it is in the Vice City vanilla game. Okay. And I have to say, Jeffrey in this mod looks and acts rather uh, similar to uh, a certain crooked lawyer. Flint, baby, it's been too long. Good to see you. Baby? Let me guess, you're still snorting that idiot fuel, aren't you? You're a funny guy. Haven't I always said what a funny guy you are, Flint Casey? Come on, Jeff, I'm just breaking your balls. Jokes aside, you're not actually going to go to the funeral looking like that, are you? Look, I could barely book the flight. My head's a complete mess. Where can I get a cheap suit? We can hit poses on the way there. Get in the car and I'll show you the way. Come on, you're driving. Yeah. As always. There's no such thing as a Grand Theft Auto game or a Grand Theft Auto mod in which the player protagonist does... 99.9% .9 of the driving. Okay. Now, Posers is the new jock sport. Yes, where you pick up the uh, country club outfit in Four Iron in Vice City. You know, the nice ass baby cutscene. And you might notice that some of the pedestrian character models in this mod are taken from Vice City stories. Alright. This suit better be a good fit. We're already running late. Okay, so again, this demo only covers Act 1 of this mod. 
so this playthrough is going to be a bit uh, shorter than usual. Now, I had a wee look at uh, the video walkthrough of this demo made by Willsey, and I noticed in the comments section there's a pinned comment from the mod creators, and according to them, they are working on the rest of the missions in this mod. However, that comment was posted 11 months ago, at the time of me making this video. So, we'll see, we'll see. As they say, good things come to those who wait. Okay, almost there. And that's a new billboard, all right. Look out, there's a gunman on the roof. Flint, take cover. Ouch. It's like Undertaker from GTA 4. I got this. Go to hell, you bastard. He's done for. Good shot. Christ, we'd be dead if you didn't have that gun on you. Hashtag instant cremation. They're driving off. We can still catch up to them. Burn rubber. That was similar to uh, Judy Fury, in which the Jura's car gets crashed into by a Spand Express truck. Alright. Oh, hi, car. Okay. I remember when I uh, first played this mission in this demo, um, the crew kept uh, driving into that wall. And by the way, sorry, look at the map. Yes, that's new. And that's a new road linking downtown with Little Haiti. Yes, back there. Right, so, oh god. Oh god. Flippin' Nick. If he's got stuck, I'm not going to be happy. Uh, and there's nothing I can do. He's stuck there. He's not going to move. If, if I go any closer, he'll see me. If I go too far away, I'll lose him. Uh, now nah, he's well and truly stuck. Let me reload. Okay, take two. Action. Right, next time drive around the obstacles, Mr. Driver. That's better, so far. Just don't get too close, we're not too far away either. And this isn't a blind playthrough, no. As mentioned, I have, I have played through this mod before. As in the demo, rather. Jesus. Easy there. Not too close. Come on. Okay. So this is the spot. You have no idea how lucky you are to be alive right now. You can also consider your business with the boss over. You're gonna let us off on this? For Seti got all the answers he was looking for, thanks to you. He's suspecting your call right now, as a matter of fact. For Seti? Shit, Casey. This is big. I've heard a lot about him. The Harwood Butcher. He practically runs this whole town. Is there anyone in this shithole who we can trust? Someone with connections? Hmm. I could reach out to the chief of the Havana PD. A pig. Great. Why should he be doing us any favours? We play poker together. Old man sure likes to gamble. I'll arrange a meeting or something. We'll see what he has to say on all this. Want to ride back to the hotel? I'd rather take a walk, get my thoughts together. Thanks, Jeffrey. 
I'll stick around until we start getting answers. We need a place to stay. Here, take this. It's the least I can do. Should be enough to have the hotel covered. I appreciate it. Sure thing. Stop by the restaurant when you're settled. When you've settled. Alright, take care now. Okay, one mission down, 20 something more to go. Yeah, so in this demo there's 20 something missions. So again, it only covers Act 1. So if um, a final version of this mod ever sees a release, I will definitely, definitely do a playthrough. Right, might as well head back and save. And do some more missions for Jeff. What's this vehicle called, by the way? Galaxy, okay. You might notice that there are um, some vehicles in this mod which are also vehicles in uh, GTA 4 and 5. And by the way, let's see if I can get some free armour and shotgun runs from these cop cars and a SWAT van. Oh, okay. Yay, nice one. Trebian, right. Get the unlocked cop car boing. <laughs> so, there are quite a few missions in this demo which are very creative especially uh, the RC missions later on in the demo. I'll look forward to playing them again. Alright. And that mission's title didn't appear when I started the mission, but that was called Vice Connection. Right. Donut Muncher car, let's move. Quack. Yep, the duck is back, everybody. Mean Street Deliveries. What's up, Jeffrey? This business is going to shit, Flint. If things continue this way, we'll have to close down. What? I thought you were going to help me. I called the chief. He said he'll be in touch. But right now, I could seriously use some help, Flint, and I can't go to the cops. Calm down. What the hell's going on? There's this other fast food joint. They've been messing with my drivers all month. And guess what? I just got a call and it's happening as we speak. No problem. I'll take care of it. Hey, I'm trying to run a legitimate business here. I know you. You'll st steal a car and run them over or shoot them. I don't need that, Flint. I'll ask politely and they'll leave your delivery boy alone. Good. If you see their truck, smash it up too. But no dead bodies, Flint. So remember, no dead bodies. You have to be careful in this mission. Inflict too much damage and the mission will fail. Right. You're going to be making deliveries in a wheelchair now. You might as well give up now. Hell, I can bypass the time lock. Huh? Who's this clown? I don't want you I don't want to catch you giving Jeff a hard time again. You let your boss know. We'll see about that, asshole. Alright. So just just do 
running attacks with your fists. And then all three of them do eventually give up individually. That's enough, please, enough. Oh. Try not to let that baseball bat guy hit them accidentally. Stop, I can't, I'm finished. And then once he goes down, I've got to use his bat to smash up the truck, just like in Judy Fury. But with a bat, not a hammer. Come on. There we are. I would use the shotgun, but I don't want to blow it up and accidentally kill those guys. What the hell? I'm calling the cops. I just saved his ass, and that's how he thanks me. He drops a fucking dime on me. Uh, some people. Now because this demo only covers Act 1 of the mod, I'm uh, going to assume that um, you can only get up to 4 stars. Okay. Now I did see a police bribe somewhere in this mod. I can't remember exactly where. Never mind. I'll just go with the pain spray. When I uh, played this mission, I didn't go with the pain spray. No, I just collected that cop bribe I mentioned. But again, I can't remember exactly what it is. So let's see if this spray shop visit is free of charge. Is indeed. Cool. Careful. Right. I'm just going to do the next mission. Not going to bother saving. Next up, rough competition. Nice piano. Ah, you're here. You're right on time because I could use some more help. Right, what's the problem now? It's that other restaurant, man. They've got this new delivery truck. The owner's rubbing it in my face. I'm going to make him regret it. Flint, that truck. How about you blow it up? I'll pay. Sure, but what happened to no cops, no dead bodies? He's been messing with me for too long. It's time to hit him hard. I left a car for you. It's rigged with explosives. Make sure it only makes contact with the truck. If you bail from the car on time, it'll look like an accident. No one will suspect we had anything to do with it. Okay. I remember this mission. It's not hard, but timing is everything. So, after Avery asked Tommy Versetti to blow this building up one year ago, it's now been made into something else. As you can see, right. Okay. Drive carefully. As they say in Driver 2, it's heavy with the jelly. As in, it's heavily laden with things that might go bang. Right, go on, cars get out of the way. Just a second. 
sec. Just trying to avoid hitting that car. Here they come. Let's launch this car into the truck. Aye, aye, Captain. Boom! Oh, I almost missed it there, bloody hell. <laughs> Good job. Well played. And oh, this time, I will save. Nice car. Quack. Almost a second quack right there as well. Never mind. You can't win all the time. How is it raining inside, by the way? Piss off Idaho. What's a Pib's favourite car? The Idaho. Oh, God. And there goes that tumbleweed right on time. Eagle Eye. Ah, yes. No more favours, Jeffrey. I need answers. Did you manage to get a hold of that cop up and running errands for you? He said he'll call Flint. I don't know when, though. I know someone else who's well connected. He's from that Cuban gang in Little Havana. I like having him around to keep the competition in line. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, you make him jump out of red cars for you when I'm not around. <laughs> Not quite, but my guy, Eriko, is meeting someone at the mall in Washington later today. More precisely, he wants that someone taken out while they have their meeting. He was going to pay someone else to do it, but I suggested you. The target's some low-life drug dealer. You shouldn't worry about it. It better be worth, better be worth my time, Jeff. What else do I need to know? I've left a rifle for you. Pick it up from ammunition store in Ocean Beach. Take out the dealer and keep an eye on Eriko. Right. I like the fact that in um, this mod it specifically mentions the fact that um, some weapons are out of stock until later. Yeah, never said that in the vanilla game, did it? No. Closing down sale. So I wonder, does that mean at some point in the final version of the mod Will this uh, ammunition no longer be here? Maybe. And now we can go to the roof of the Washington Mall, or upstairs anyway, using a certain staircase which is blocked off in the vanilla game, yes. This one. At least I'm pretty sure this is blocked off in Vice City. Alright. Alright. And... Oh god, I almost shot him. <laughs> Jeez. Who... Oh, it's the fucking police. Of course it is. Just a minute. Oh, nice. I'm Flint Casey. Jeffrey sent me. Ah, see. Good shooting, amigo. I'm Eriko. Listen, I parked my car nearby. Let's get out of here, eh? 
Right, if he gets run over by a donut muncher outside, I'm not going to be best pleased. Nah, he shouldn't. I think his car is just here. Yeah, this Cuban Hermes. You drive, amigo. Take us back to the hood. And I can confirm that you can uh, make law enforcement vehicles stop by shooting them in this mod as well. Yep. I'm not going to do that just yet. Got to conserve ammo. Ah, the graphics in this mod are lovely. Gorgeous. And yes, there's a SWAT van at that police station in this mod as well. Oh. And you might have noticed there's no police scanner lady. Good. <laughs> Look, a new road. Lovely. Any cool. I'm looking for the people that disrupted the funeral downtown earlier this week. I need you to keep your ears out for me. Be quiet back there. It's a personal matter, so I'm willing to do some work for any info you can give me. I hear you, Holmes. The funeral. Hmm. I think I could help you out. There's always work for you here if you want to roll with, with, with La Familia. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Never mind. Delivery service. I was supposed to make that cop shut the hell up. Never mind. Hey, muchacho, you looking for trouble? Why don't you tell the ladies to stop waving those guns? Haha, <laughs> alright, boys. You said you could use some help. Well, here I am. Bueno, ha, huh? muy bueno. I have something you could do for us. There's a truck with some goods over the docks. The shipment just came in. Be a good boy and deliver it to our warehouse. Good boy? Do I look like a dog to you? Sorry amigo, my bad. Just do what I ask, okay? Haha, <laughs> un pero errado, eh? And I apologise if I said that wrong. And by the way, that is Spanish for an angry dog. Oh, whatever. I apologise for that dreadful noise earlier. You can blame that donut muncher. He got his mouth and eyes mixed up. And he's been putting his donuts in his eyes, not his mouth. Okay, this is uh, kind of similar to robbing Uncle Sam from San Andreas, well, at least the uh, opening the gate part is anyway. Locked gate, no problem. One destroyed keypad and one open gate. One Benson, thank you very much. But, once again, the Haitians give us trouble. Yes, please, the Mac has a higher rate of fire. Right, just be careful, I've lost a wheel. I think. Oh no, I think that was, uh must be one of their cars instead. Okay, fine. Suits me. Makes the trip to the warehouse a lot easier. I think I'll take the wide road here. Without getting rammed as I go around the corner. It's in the bag, surely. No, I think you'll find it's in the truck. The shipment is in the truck. 
Oh god, the Haitians hate me already. Clearly. Right. Oh shit. Where the hell did he come from? Ta-da! Good job, man. You got some cojones. I was chased by a bunch of Haitians. What kind of goods were you talking about? In that truck? Guns, amigo. Lots of guns. Right. I think I'll do one or maybe two more missions for Eriko and then I'll save. Because at the moment there uh, isn't a safe house in this part of town that I can use. I can't be arsed driving all the way back to Ocean Beach just yet. I mean, if there are viable safe houses in this demo, I'm not sure. I mean, I haven't seen any yet. Uh Bullet dance. Idiotas. They can't stop us now. They don't know what's coming. That incident with the truck could have seriously gone wrong, man. My bad, Flint. We've been at war with these putas since... always. Speaking of which, why do you keep those weapons in their territory? They'll never think of looking for those armas there. They're blind, amigo. We've also got our stronghold hidden right in the middle of their turf. We're preparing to go to war. If you want to make a good impression, now is the time. Some compañeros are at the bar. You can go and help them out. I'll give you the location, but you can't let a single Haitian spot you on the way there. Okay. So for this mission... Yeah. Whenever a group of Haitians spawn on the street... You have to find your way around them. So keep an eye on that radar. And the streets as well. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Oh, oh. Ah, shit. So you don't, you don't spot them straight away. That's the problem. It's even more difficult if they're in a car. Okay. Right. Out the bloody way, come on. Right. And by the way, you can skip cutscenes in this mod by pressing the Enter Vehicle button. In my case, Return. Well, I'm pretty sure you can only skip the uh, opening. Bloody hell, cutscenes! <laughs> Jeez! Don't make me tell Eriko. Right. Oh, fuck's sake, what is it with pissed off drivers here? There's been no shots fired. Right, keep an eye out for... Haitian gang cars as well, then. Uh, those are Cubans. It wasn't my fault. I didn't spot the Haitian gang car right away. I think that's a Haitian gang car up ahead here on the right. I think not, actually. Well, there's... Right. I saw those guys on the pavement on the right. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, really? Let's try again. I mean, I remember when I first played this mission, I was able to just uh, drive around them. You know, go on the other side of the road and they never spotted me. Fine. Okay, third time is the charm, hopefully. Right, no more pissed off drivers to... Turn him into pavement pizza this time. Hopefully not. Good. Right. This time. I'm going to... Take a slightly longer way around. As soon as little Haiti appears on the screen. Oh. 
I think it already has actually. <laughs> right. Okay. They'll never see me down here. <clears throat> So it looks like the Haitian gang cars in this mod are green. Oh, good. There, third time's the charm, indeed. Here we go. Specky's bar. Hola, amigo. You flint? Yeah. Let's go inside, we can't talk out here. Ho ho! Yes. There she is. You like what you see, Chico? I'm impressed. You know how to handle her. Maybe a couple of Haitians too? Guess I owe them that much. I'll take a shot at it, if you know what I mean, amigo. See? Si. The shots you at the bar, hombre. Afterwards, you can go and do your thing. Right. Next round is on the Haitians. They hang out at the Crocs bar. And yes, we do have to uh, fight the enemy gang while well drunk. Yes. And now, you can go near the Haitians without failing the mission. And yes, this is where the uh, White Stallions bar was in Vice City Stories, here where the mission The Bum Deal takes place. Okay. So the drunk cam um, doesn't affect your driving. No, it only affects you're shooting. You don't have to use the minigun if you don't want to. Now you can just uh, get in a vehicle and do drive-bys on them. Yeah, it's easier. Oh. As long as you don't get yanked out by them. Or blown up. Right, I'm smoking. This is GTA, not the mask. Right. I see more green. Right. Might be worth getting a brand new car. Oh look, they're inside the pizza shop. Fine, I will do this. Oh god! Like there's armour inside the bar from what I remember. Yeah, right there. Okay, fine. If I can lure them to this window, I can hit them with the bat through the glass. Or just let them kill each other like twats. Hold on. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, hit them. Ah, Jesus Christ, it's not working too well. There it is now. Right. Where are they now? Oh, fuck it. I think I'm going to get killed, unfortunately. Right. Be careful. Come on then, I'm waiting. I think they're coming in a car now, or are they on foot again? Or they're in this, in this alley, that's right. I remember. More spawned in the pizza shop. Yeah, I never had uh, this much trouble with uh, massive amounts of health and armor losses when I first played this mission. Oh well. That's right, out you come. Come and get the pretty SMG bullets. Right. I'll get that guy who's just spawned up there. Better. That's more like it. 
And the drunk effect just happens to wear off once the mission is over. Right, one guy left. Why is he all the way over there? Bloody hell. Can you buy pizzas in this mod, by the way? You can. Good. And I practice on I never tried doing that. I'll be perfectly honest with you. Right, where the hell has this guy disappeared to? Uh Uh, ah, there. Okay. Just baseball about the fucker. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. God. That could have been fatal. Well done. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> right. Anyway, let's get one more mission out of the way for Eriko, and then I'll save. First, I'll uh, get a quick refill of health from the pizza shop. And then I'll also get some armor from that SWAT van at the Little Havana police station. Yeah, I forgot that when you're not on a mission and you go to buy some food, You've got a conversation to sit through. Right. Tell you what, I'll get the armor once the mission has started. If memory serves me right, this mission is a bit tough. Or is that the next one? I can't remember. Okay, it's not. Big trouble in Little Havana. So what's about this funeral, Flint? My brother. It was his funeral. I know what it's like to lose family. My own brother, Rico, was killed not long ago. When we arrived at the funeral, we heard shooting and... Eriko! Eriko! Que pasa, man? The Haitians, they're attacking us! They want some more? I thought they got the message. We'll take care of it, Eriko. I'll run, run up the others, make ourselves useful. Okay. So this one is uh, kind of similar to uh, Big Rumble in Little China from Liberty City Stories and uh, Balls from Vice City Stories. Only this time there's no uh, Havoc meter. Right, I might as well get some ammo. And they're easier to kill this time around as well. Quack. Boink. Did I get a pistol? Yeah, I did. Okay. One, two, fuck you. Kitchik. Piss off, bonnet, thank you. Must have heard me. Good. Get the hell up, come on. Mm. Squish. I'm getting hungry. Oh, the first Tom eat now me. Quack. How would you like it if someone ran you over? Well, you just found out how it feels. My god, Stu. Didn't want to pick up the ammo. Nah, I couldn't be arsed on that occasion.
Vice City's roads and streets have received a bit of an upgrade. And yes, those are indeed shoes hanging from the phone lines. Right, hold on. Let me... Can I just uh, shoot them out? I guess not. Well, I can. With enough uh, bullets. Because I saw blood on the ground. Nice one, guys. <laughs> I can get that ammo right back. Well done. Right, they're on the move by the looks of things. Quack, again. Oh god, careful. Nice. <laughs> Final targets. Thank God. Right, I'll uh, make a quick quick trip to the police station. Get the health. I mean, armor, sorry. And yes, that is a rampage. I tried that rampage in a practice run. It's a sniper rifle rampage. Dead easy, actually. Yeah, dead easy. Now, it's not always unlocked, but it is on this occasion, thankfully. Right, go on. You never know. I might need it. Okay, that'll do. Alright, one more mission for Eriko, then I'll save in Ocean Beach. Ah, here we go. Sex, drugs and rock and roll. This one's a bit challenging. Listen, I spoke to the boss, told him about you. The boss? Yeah, Umberto Rubina, huge cojones. He wants to meet you in person, Flint. But there's something he needs you to do for him first. I figured as much. Everyone in this town needs a favour. What is it? <coughs> we got to help a Haitian strip club in New Downtown. Come on, we'll talk later. Let's go. Yes, New Downtown. Yep, that's quite simply that uh, new area in Downtown. Which is, uh, yeah, where that pink blip is. There's a very good reason I got uh, full health and armour before starting this mission. You'll see why. Right, so instead of going all the way to the end of this road, I can just turn left right here. Yep. And I bet in the full version of the mod, a mission will take place at that multi-storey car park back there. There they are. So what now? I just kill them? We didn't drive all the way out here to compliment them on their manners. Get rid of them. I'll watch your back from here. I'm assuming that, yeah, of course, it's bloody locked. Right. Um, I would rather use a car. To do a drive by on them, but forget it. Right, I'll hide behind here. Let them come to me. Okay. Okay, dead easy. Next. And yes, their shirts say chill, not relax this time. Looks like they're having a meeting, Flint. Kill them all. Ride the lightning. Master of puppets. Okay. Right, 
The twins and other strippers from the pole position club have made their reappearance. Right. See that guy behind the bar on the left? Yeah, he has a spaz shotgun. I need to be careful. Or I could take him out first. Good, the mission. The mission doesn't fail if you do that. Ah, shit, man. At least the mission doesn't fail if you kill the wrong people. Mm, sorry. I think that's all the enemies dead. Yeah. Carl, quick, get in! Hey, I think I found something useful for you. You did good, amigo. Let's get out of here. Can I get that cash? I can, nice. Dismount bonus, yep. Oh, <laughs> kind of backfired though. Never mind. Not far now, amigos. You were right, they were holding a meeting. That's what I got the case. You did great, hombre. Umbert will be very grateful for everything you've done. This is what I, call serious business, mate. I don't think he's around at the moment. I'll be at the barn that we hate you later. Wanna meet there? Have you heard anything about the funeral? Nothing. The Haitians seem to have spread to downtown. Maybe there's something on it in the documents you found. Right. So since I've not saved in a while, I'm going to do just that. Uh, come on. Okay. I know there's uh, one car in this mod, which is... God, it's just ridiculously slow. It's even worse than the Idaho and Perennial. God, it's a horrible vehicle. Oh, never mind. Well... On my way back... I'll get more armour. Let's see if I can get that dirt bike. I can't. He doesn't know how to ride that bike, clearly. I can't remember if I mentioned this already, but there are um, Vice City Stories pedestrians in this mod as well. That's better. A lot better than that piece of crap car known as a chief back there. All right. Shame there's not an enforcer at the uh, police station here. That would have been ideal. Never mind, it is what it is. All right. Floppy disk icon, here I am. BRB. Right, well, let's continue.
know in my luck the um, Enforcer will be locked again, but then again, I suddenly remembered th Remember that armor inside the crocs bar? It always spawns there. Yeah, it's not it's not a one-off Okay I haven't checked out Tommy's old mansion in this mod yet And that's a rampage as well that's a rampage as well. It's a katana rampage. I've only done two rampages in this mod. Blood? What in the name of Christ is that? <laughs> it looks like, some looks like something you'd seen in Silent Hill 3. God, what was that? <laughs> I wonder if maybe um, that vehicle's texture just didn't load. What? What is going on? <laughs> well, hopefully uh, when I uh, start this mission, those uh, graphical bugs will go away. Okay. If they don't, I can always uh, reload my save. I saw something inside that taxi depot back there, you know, before the door loaded. Right, handle this. Hey, Ariko, how's it going? Malo, amigo. Malo. Well, was that case useful at all? We've got the locations of a bunch of vans. Turns out the Haitians have been one step ahead of us this whole time. We suspected it, but now we know for sure. They're smuggling weapons. We can't steal those vans, it's too risky. But I've got an idea. How about we dump them into the water, then quickly snatch everything from one place? You'll use my bulldozer to pick up and dump each van into the ocean. Got it. I'll pick up from the construction site and meet you at the docks. Bueno. I'll get the boat then. Also, bye Sanchez. It was nice knowing you. Now I've got to risk a losing armour while I try to get a brand new vehicle such as this one right here okay it's not a voodoo it's a stiletto whether or not I'll complete all of this demo in oh god in uh, <laughs> in one recording session I doubt it, but as I said, this playthrough will be pretty damn short compared to my uh, other playthroughs. Ooh. Yeah, don't be surprised if this playthrough only ends up being uh, two or three parts long. For my next playthrough, I'm considering doing, um, where the hell am I going, uh, San Andreas with uh, the challenge San Andreas mod. Yeah, I know previously I said I want to do Titan Andreas first. Well, I'm leaning closer to uh, saying I've changed my mind. Yeah, the only way to get in the cab of this bulldozer is to uh, climb on top of a vehicle. Yeah, because the door's too high up to for you to reach it from ground level. And don't worry about the scoop, because um, as soon as you drive up to one of the vans, the van is automatically attached to the scoop. All you have to do is press either look left or look right to uh, drop the van into the water. 
Yeah, in other words, it's a lazy version of the bulldozer from San Andreas. And don't worry, I'm only having a laugh. I'm not uh, having a go at the mod creator. No, no, no. It was just a turn of phrase, as they say. Right, so collect the part vans and bring them to Eriko. However you are timed. If you make Eriko wait too long, he'll not stick around. Okay. Now, I know that doesn't look like a very long time, but the clock actually resets each time you uh, drop a van into the water. And I can't look behind either, because that makes a van drop as well. And those are grenades. Yep, that blue halo represented grenades. Oh god, please don't get busted, please don't get busted. Good, right. Clock has reset, let's move. Oh Christ, one star's come right back. Thank God one star's go away on their own. Well, given that the uh, driver door is uh, too high up to be reached from ground level, maybe it's uh, not possible for cops to uh, bust you when you're in a bulldozer. No idea. I've never uh, tried it to find out for sure. Right. Plop. Good. You think you lied or something? Next one's right beside the pain spray. Yeah. The whole city's a dangerous place. Let alone the docks. Okay. Easy now. I'm just being careful because when I first played this mission in a practice run, I ended up uh, failing the mission after uh, dropping the first van into the water somehow, although it might have been because um, I um, almost knocked the uh, bulldozer into the water as well. Right, easy now, easy now. Piss off, Parker. 20 seconds, gotta move on, come on. Running out of time. Just don't press left or right or look behind just yet. Well done, with one second remaining. I checked all the locations, those were all the vans I could find. Weren't you supposed to bail before I finished the job? Chico, I wouldn't have stuck around if it took you any longer. We're lucky nobody called the cops on us, I take no chances. It's actually surprising that I wasn't caught trying to manoeuvre that bathtub. Doesn't matter now, I've managed to scavenge some decent stuff. So it's all on you now, Eriko. Retrieve those weapons. Do what you gotta do. But don't forget your promise. I haven't heard anything about that funeral, amigo. Alright, what about Umberto? You said you wanted to see me. Umberto will know you helped me today, amigo. I give you my word. I'll be knocking on your door if I don't get a phone call soon. Ooh, a threat. Okay. I heard something from upstairs, I think. Was that uh, the upstairs neighbor's dog? Hmm. Oh, look, the Versetti gang are still here. Do or do not, there is no try. Okay, next mission for Eriko. Just 
getting comfy. Right. I'm curious to know why there's um, icons on the radar for the uh, the car showroom and uh, the biker bar in downtown. Well, if that is the car showroom, what, what does it say on the legend? Uh, oh, son, yeah, it is the car showroom. Okay, and that's a bike shop up there. Okay. Well, I don't know if um, those uh, features can actually be uh, used in uh, this demo. No idea. Never tried. Right, if memory serves me right, I think this next mission for Eriko involves a bit of uh, snippety sniping again. And by the way... So where the hell was that going? Oh. I was wondering why I couldn't see those shoes properly. They disappear when you zoom in close enough. Right, more like am you nothing. Okay, I'm not repeating that. Eriko, are you there? Open up! Oh, Dios mio. Flint, is that you? I think I'll come back later. No, wait. One thing. Come on, baby. One th thing. Eriko, I don't have time for this right now. No, no, not you, Mama. I'm talking to him. Flint, ammunition. They're transporting more guns now. Be careful. Cops and their personal <coughs> protection. Jesus. Okay, whatever. Just tell me where and I'll get them. From the docks to downtown, Flint. From the docks to downtown, Flint. Okay. Uh, actually, I'm going to use this. From what I remember, this mission was quite challenging. And this isn't the one involving sniping, by the way. No, this is something else. Come on, I don't have time for this right now. I am against the clock. That vehicle can shift. And again, so can this. This donut muncher car. Right, and it is guarded. Right. Let me take out that guy on the back of the truck first, or try to at least. Ah, that's annoying. Oh, he's crashed. Good. Hold on. I might be able to hijack it right here, right now. Ah, oh, no such luck. Right, hold on. Right, go. I got lucky when I first played this mission here, yeah, it got stuck against uh, a big object. Right, if I'm able to, I'll see if I can uh, shoot the driver in the face to get him out. Can I get him up against a tree? Or something. Yeah, I can't wreck that van. I have to steal it for myself. Mm. Right. Right, I see that pickup truck's not helping. Oh, you lucky bastard. Now, hold on, let me get this. I'm gonna get ahead of him. I oh, know. Shoot the driver in the face. He's, he's just gonna keep grinding against that fence. I'm just going to shoot him out with the sniper rifle. Got him. Right, don't get run over by that guy. Go! Right, hold on. Oh, I almost lost a wheel. That spike strip. Right, all I've got to do is get to the pain spray and then we're good to go. Remember, shoot law enforcement vehicles in this game, and they stop. Lifesaver. Oh shit! Gee, oh no! No, 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 no! Stop, 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 stop! Oh, jeez! Oh god! I 
from what I remember, I think the van actually gets a health refill once you've got in it. Oof, that was close. Jeez. Well played, that man. Okay. Well, I think they keep uh, harassing you, though. Okay. I don't see any more uh, vehicle graphical glitches anymore. <laughs> Where's the, uh, oh, the end point, it's just outside Specky's bar, that's right. Yeah, here we go. The boss will like this. Gracias, my friend. Gracias, my man. <laughs> Hello. Hey, amigo, this is Eriko. As promised, I spoke to Umberto. Told him you've got, told him you've got cojones. You can meet him at Cafe Rubina whenever you like. Hey man, thanks. Not a problem, man. Oh, and one more thing. One of our guys just moved out, so there's a crib available. You can have it. Let it be your new home. Good luck, amigo. And why is a gang war not broken out yet? Those are Haitians and those are the Versetti gang. And of course they go for me. <laughs> right, as you saw, there's a new safe house available for me. Not too far from where we met Eriko. So I'll save there once I've got my butt in a car. Okay. Tell you what. After I've saved, I'll reload and hopefully that'll clear the uh, graphical bugs with the vehicles. Never seen that before. Bloody hell, what was that? <laughs> Jeez. Okay. You know, Flint, if you want... um people to burgle your house just uh, keep leaving that door wide open yeah best strategy ever okay wait doesn't doesn't this mission involve uh, sniping yes this is pretty much the uh, stallion from GTA 4 Okay, Umberto. Sea Warriors. Haha, <laughs> you know you can't handle a real man. Creep! You must be Umberto Rubina. And who are you supposed to be? Flint Casey. Does that tell you anything? Ah, so you're the kid Eriko spoke of. Said you've got big cojones. Said the same about you. Just can't get enough balls, can he? <phone rings> Trying to be funny, eh? I like that. See, si, Humberto. Okay? Those putas, I can't believe it. Coño, Eriko's in trouble. You gotta warn him fast. Well, I would, Umberto, if you told me what's happening. I sent that kid down to the docks to, cl to clean up those vans. The plan was to transport any remaining weapons to a safe location nearby in his boat. Just got a message that he was followed, those puta Haitians. I'll tell you where to go. Now show me that you've got some balls. Ah, now I think I remember which mission involves... Sniping for Umberto. I know what this mission is all about. Yep. This one's quite fun. Well, as long as you don't let the targets get too close to you. Or enemies, whatever.
Hey, amigo, what are you doing here? Bad news, amigo. This is a setup. What are you talking about? The Haitians, they're going to show up any second. Let's get to the boat. Right, so this is very similar to, yep, supply and demand. Good, got the driver and the gunner. Right, the reason I said don't let them get too close is because, um, unlike supply and demand, your boat in this mission is not explosion proof. Your point? Well, if you uh, blow up one of the... Oh dear, that's never happened before. Yeah, if you blow up one of those boats when it's uh, too close to Eriko's boat, it will lose a massive chunk of health. Jeez, that's never happened before. I don't know if that was me shooting Eriko by mistake or if uh, one of the Haitians got him. Hmm. I'm leaning closer to saying it was the latter. Anyway, I'll hit fast forward until I am back at Eriko's boat. Okay, take two. Oh, come on, get that gunner without shooting Eriko. Bloody hell. Jesus Christ, that was close. Right, where's the other guy? Okay, they're fucking about. Yeah, I was scared of accidentally shooting uh, Eriko there. Come on. Let me get the driver as Get him away from the fucking boat. Bloody hell. Jeez. If this thing tips over, I'm not going to be best pleased. Okay. I bet it lost uh, just as much health from the boats grinding against it. And not just uh, getting shot at by that guy who uh, nearly caused me to uh, shoot a Rico in the face accidentally. Got the driver, that's fine. Okay. Good. They fucked up. Here's hoping I don't get fucked up. Next in line to get fucked up, your best bet is to stay away, motherfuckers. It's just one of those days. Look at the sky. How delightful. What's well, not so delightful is this crap. This ambush. Oh. Uh oh. That's gonna blow up in our face and kill us. No, it's not. We're good. Smashing. Or more like splatting. Or splashing. Okay. I've got less than a quarter of my boat health left. Be careful. So yeah, as you can see, the AK-47 replaces the Ruger in this mod. Nice. I got the driver. That's fine. And the gunner is too dumb to take the wheel himself and shoot at the same time. I think I got the... Oh. Got that gunner. That's fine. Oh, flipping it. See, I would shoot. I would shoot the drivers, but um, 
I might accidentally blow the boats up when they're right beside our boat. Mm. This thing's just going to get wrecked or flipped upside down. It's already smoking. Stay away. Almost shot Eriko there. Okay. I'd like to think that's all of them. Good. I'll drop you off at that pier. That was tense. I can make your hands clap. I love that song. It's very popular in South Korea. Way. Okay. I might as well save again. Good for you, man. Oh look, the vehicle graphical bugs are back again. No idea what's causing this. I never saw this when I uh, first played this mod in a practice run. Hmm, bizarre. Okay. Okay. Off the hook, let's move. That's right, run. Usain Bolt would be proud. Hi Donut Muncher, bye Donut Muncher. Get Cortez. I'm sick of these putas. And you, you're all a bunch of useless lady boys. Get out, I don't want to see you. Are, are you alright there, Umberto? Oh, how can't you see? They're going to kill him for real this time. Eriko is safe. Everything should be fine now. They couldn't get Eriko, so they took my nephew instead. He was working at the construction site. He was minding his own business. They took him hostage there, and my men, girls, they did nothing about it. I'm just guessing, but I assume the Haitians did this. Yes, and my men, no balls. Nada. But you... <laughs> Enough, please. <laughs> You've got balls, I like that. Uh, why don't I go check up on your nephew? Oh god, the timing was fucking perfect right there. Right, um, yes, of course, that cop is in that cop car. Okay. Ah! Lamp post! Seven stars playthrough memories. Oh, but Stu, just one question. How did you get seven stars? I was going to say I used a mod, but that is crap. Right. I think that enemy's flattened on, under the car. I'll quickly grab the AK and that new SMG. Yeah, him. Okay. Right. If anybody wants to tell me what uh, gun this is, I would. Uh, that would be appreciated because I have no idea what this is. This gun, no idea at all. I mean, I think I've seen it before, but I just don't know what it's called. Right, I'll. Uh, and I would rather save the sniper rounds for later. Because the last mission in this uh, demo is a bit challenging, I must say. Let's grab that quickly before it buggers off. Good, I can. Oh. Wow, still no damage. Amazing. Pew. Pick it up. Right. <laughs> Shh. 
shit boxes, shit boxes everywhere. And finish the fucker off. Hey, Umberto sent me. Let's get out of here. Okay. And okay. I would rather not uh, jump down there with him. Just in case he has hardly any health left, also known as made of paper. Oh dear, someone died while playing Twister. Right, um, how is my car looking? And it looks like I made. Uh, yeah, I did make them stop, good. Okay. Open, amigo. Quack. Ah, it's nice and peaceful with no police scanner lady yapping in my ear. And ah, Jesus! Hold on a minute. Hold on just a minute. Let me. Uh, been around without getting blown up or busted or anything. Right. Bloody spike strips, you gotta love them, not. Oh god, a roadblock. Okay, pink markers right there. You're good to go. Well played. All things considered. I wonder if I can... Nah, I don't want to steal that. Just in case I get busted. Right. Right, save again. Firearms, no more. You seem to be having a rough week, Umberto. I do. It's because I'm tired, amigo. Tired of this war. Tired of all these Haitian putas. But my men, they trust me. i got to stay strong for my men. You can get stronger by weakening your enemy. Ever looked at it that way? Yes, I've tried everything, even things I'm not proud of. If the Haitians still have access to weapons, why don't we shut down their supplier? Where do they get their guns? Ammunition? They have some supplies left over at the ammunition in downtown. Listen, muchacho, go there and waste their supplies then, if it's that easy. Consider it done, muchacho, amigo, Umberto. Good. Take the remaining guns to Phil Cassidy. He's not hard to find. Leave them with nothing. Nothing but their own dicks in their hands. Charming. Okay. Wrong weapon. My bad. Let's go. Right, so we're going to the... Uh area behind ammunition in downtown where hog tide takes place in vice city and once again we can use the new road that goes through new downtown to get there yep right freaking here handy as hell
And from what I remember, the enemies in this mission put up uh, quite a good fight. So you have to be careful. Double quack. Yeah. You can either use a vehicle or use grenades to blow up those boxes. Like so. Pop. Oh god. Right, let me, uh, can I get in this van? I can. Good. Okay. Yeah, a lot of the uh, enemies in this mission uh, spawn behind you. They give you some nasty surprises. Oh, oh. Right, um, okay, hold on. Take that guy up there. Like so. Puff. Just a minute. Yeah, I thought there was somebody behind me. Oh god, hold on a minute, hold on. Just a minute. He's not dead. He is now. With a baseball bat to the nuts. That's sure to kill him. Okay. Oh, hold on a minute. Come on. Fire, 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 fire. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, come on. Now is not the time to do shit like that. Please, no flat tires, if you don't mind. I was thinking about getting some armour from uh, the Crocs bar on the way back, but I don't think I want to with that fucker chasing me. I'll probably, probably end up losing it. Then again, I'm not going far south enough to even reach uh, the Crocs bar in this mission. What business have you got on my property, son? You're Phil? This is Phil's place. I wear Phil's clothes. Of course I'm Phil. Umberto Rubina thinks you might be needing some extra firepower. Rubina who? This must be for Tommy. Don't know nothing about it. I was told to bring these weapons to you. Whatever you say, don't get lost on your way out or you might catch a bullet. It's nice meeting you too. <laughs> oh dear, I think that um, excessive boomshine use has uh, fucked with his uh, politeness, shall we say, or manners. Contender, ready. Gladiator, ready. Uh, nah, I was going to get, um, wait a minute, did I drive right past Crocs? I think I did. <laughs> yeah, I was going to get some, yeah, here it is, I was going to get some health from the pizza shop, but, uh, you get a free health refill by saving anyway, so. Who gives that at sass? Woof. It's the graphical bugs again with the vehicles. Oh, that was almost a triple quack right there. <laughs> 